Hello everyone, welcome back for another Minecraft tutorial. We are designing not one, but two different styles of wells. Uh, as you can see, like the one behind me right now. And uh, yeah, let's just go ahead and get straight into the tutorial. Start here is the layout for the well. Oops, ignore that. It is a four by four square, just follow the wool blocks right there and then around those wool place andesite slabs and on the wool itself we're going to use uh, stone brick blocks on top of those four corners of the blocks we're going to place andesite walls and we're going to do a pattern here we're going to do spruce fence posts on top of the walls and then walls back on top of the posts that's not hard to say now to do the roof uh, we're going to use warped slabs and uh, you're just going to go around the post, the walls there, and then in between those slabs, we're going to place uh, spruce trap doors. And on top of the trap doors, we're going to place more warped slabs. And uh, from there, just follow the tutorial. And uh, if anything seems kind of confusing, just let me know. Now the roof's finished, we're going to place uh, spruce trap doors around uh, between the pillars. And then one final touch, we're going to add a nice little uh, chain system using a grindstone and place a couple chains going down. We're going to use the hopper for like a bucket. Uh, you could use a cauldron if you want instead. And then on the other side, on the side of the grindstone, use another chain and we're going to use a lever connecting to that chain to kind of give it a cool... Uh, uh, pulley system effect. Alright, using the layout design here for the second well, on the four corners where the logs are, we're going to place spruce stripped logs up to four blocks high. And then surrounding each log on the bottom, the base, we're going to use trap doors. And then skip a spit block, and then on the third one, place more trap doors all the way around. And in the middle, you can place uh, spruce signs to give it a little more detail. Alright, starting here, we're going to go ahead and start at the roof. Uh, using spruce stairs, go around the edge, uh, two edges of the spruce uh, strip logs there and then in between those stairs you can place uh, spruce slabs to uh, connect them all together and then on top I'm using crimson wood you don't you can use whatever you want but here we're gonna use crimson uh, stairs on the two middle blocks and then place uh, full block planks uh, around the other sides except for the corners you're just gonna use a slab and then from here on out just go ahead and follow the tutorial if you have any questions let me know corner of the roofs you're gonna place spruce trap doors surrounding the two uh, planks there on all four corners that just gives it a little extra detail on the roof now working on the middle part we're gonna use stone bricks spruce fence posts and a spruce log all in a row there with two spruce fence posts in the middle and you're gonna do it on all four corners then just place some stone brick stairs on where the black wool is uh, going toward the middle Just of course make sure you dig down into the well so you can put your water in there and uh, Just like the first well, we're gonna place a hopper as our bucket uh, with some chains and grindstones uh, Actually use two grindstones and then on the bottom of the la outer grindstone There's a chain hanging off of there and we're gonna place another this time We're gonna use a birch uh, fence post kind of like to make it look like a handle and with that, you're all completely done uh, with the second style well.
we are in my world where I've been building all of my tutorial builds in the same place. But let's go ahead and check out not only the well as you can see behind me, but uh, I've obviously been building around it. So I want to give a little more detail around the well, give it more design. So as you can see here, I gave it a couple extra bells because this is a village, you know, and it has villagers. I don't know where they are actually because there was a few around here but now they're gone yeah I don't know I don't know where they went so uh, as you can see here I also placed some bushes and flowers around the buildings made a little bench here uh, fixed up the pathways as some steps to kind of lead around the well made like a little nice cool rocky structure you know made the terrain look a little bit nicer looking up here and uh, yeah, I had a little flower bed. I loved this little cliff edge. I didn't, so I didn't want to destroy this entire hill. Like, <laughs> I got rid of the house on top. Thought, well, I can build something on top of it later. Um, but I want, I kind of wanted to keep uh, this cliff edge and just add some flowers and stuff underneath it. And yeah, as you saw. Uh, in one of my other tutorial builds, I already built a dock, and I was like, you know what, let's throw a dock in here too. I've, I've been wanting to throw a dock in here in this village anyway, so why not throw one of my designs right here uh, next to the well. So there is that. And last but not least, I added a unique, interesting market stall, because I figured, you know, if they're coming, maybe there's some villagers, you know, dropping off um, some market stuff here into the village. So they park their boat and they come on in. And uh, and uh, they can sell their goods here, you know, <laughs> even though it's all like beef and lamb and chicken. You have some barrels up here too if you want. So um, this is an interesting design. I use like some chains to make it look like they're holding it in place. Um, yeah, I don't, I've never really built a market before either, so that's new. But yeah, the well looks freaking beautiful. And if you saw in the time lapse, I tried. To go with different type of roof like you can easily make um other colors if you'd like but you know what i really like this warped slab uh warped wood color and i'm thinking when i start redesigning the rest of these buildings i'll probably use similar colors anyway so why not um and i know i know warped wood's hard to come by if you're not in the nether um but, but i promise you there's multiple colors that you could use um, I bet granite would work um, uh, multiple different colors of wood like jungle wood uh, acacia would look cool um, any kind of wood would probably work uh, you can even just do stone I think on top probably I haven't tried stone but I think that would it, it would probably it'd probably blend a lot in with the rest of the well but you know what I think it'd look fine if you blend with like the spruce wood with stone on the roof it might look pretty cool actually so yeah um that is it for me uh hope like yeah, i didn't design the second well i don't know if i'll ever build a second well somewhere um maybe somewhere in the middle of nowhere or something i don't know you can make it like a mystic well or something like in the middle of a magic forest or something who knows maybe um but yeah that's gonna be it for me today Thank you all for watching. I appreciate all of you. And uh, yeah, till next time. See you later.